Hi everyone, I'm just drowning my sorrows with a nice cold beer. <laughs> yeah, I've just unloaded the kiln. Um, not great results. Some stuff fired better than others. These goblets turned out nice just with ash sprayed on the outside and clear glazed inside. I'm going to make a few more of these. In fact I did make half a dozen. Um, I did these different to the ones that I normally do. Um, I put them on the wheel head after throwing the top section and then threw this part separately. But on a few of them that popped off in the bisque firing. So I have to take more care next time. Decanter there. <coughs> I was actually given this wood ash by somebody. Um, seems to have much more of a shine. It's a bit odd actually. <laughs> um, I say that because these ones came out with absolutely nothing on them. Um, admittedly, I could have or should have got the kiln up to at least cone 9. Um, but as you can see, folks, that worked at um, cone 7. Uh, also, I don't think two layers in my kiln is a good idea. But it's, uh, it's got a, a shimmery shine to it, but no toastiness, which I don't understand. Um, yeah, and they had the same amount of ash, ash sprayed on as those. Tankards, here's my attempt at a batter bowl. Um, I fluted that. But again, it could have done with getting a, a bit hotter in the kiln. Um, here's the ancient jasper. Inside a bowl, wood ash on the outside. <clears throat> They were fired rim to rim and with that being oxidised inside that's turned out much more how I think the ancient jasper should look. Oops. Loads of lovely variations in the colours in there. I hope the phone's picking it up folks. Um, yeah, so the bowls are okay. There's a bit of bubbling in the bottom of that one. Maybe I didn't dust that one out. Um, that's the toasted sage. It's a bit anemic looking. Um, I prefer that in a reduction fire atmosphere actually. It comes out a nice creamy colour, this is just a uh, horrible colour. <laughs> so I'll keep these for myself. That one's gone out of shape. So once again folks, it's just a learning curve. <laughs> After this amount of time, <laughs> I would expect a, a better results, but well, these were put in raw and um, they've crawled a little bit but they're just for candle wax anyway so I just wanted to fill a couple of spaces up so I'll quickly raw glaze those okay bye for now <laughs>